Hey guys, I finally moved out of the dorm and into my own place. So sit back, relax, and enjoy the video. Okay, I want this. That's how I go every day. By the way, the shower is right in here. And we turn on. There we go. Yeah. It's actually quite nice. Easy to check. We separated our trash, and the laundry is over there. And go up these stairs. <coughs> and my door is on the right. It's room number nine. And this is my genkan, which means the place you put your shoes you actually go into the house. I have my stuff for my shower downstairs, my laundry stuff, bleach and detergent, and my dry cleaning in that side. And I separate my clothes, darks, whites, and I've done my whites yesterday. Here's the glass, separates my house from the genkan. I'm gonna close my door. I always take off your shoes and take off my flip flops and my towels here and let me give you just a full span of my house And here I press for hot water. You turn the dial for the hottest, and it actually gets really hot. So you press the button, and water comes out. And this is actually for cold water. And here's where I keep my hot water for coffee and sugar for coffee. And here's where I dry my dishes. And underneath is my shelf of things that I need to eat and my dishes. My fridge. I'll open that up for you. I have my lettuce, my water, my cheese, bread. Basically the essentials. And the essentials in the freezer as well are ice cream. <laughs> but also we have to separate our trash. Oh, I'd like to show you the view. The view from my kitchen. And here's my shelf, and by the door I keep everything I need to leave. My Suica, my amusement pass, in case I hit the arcades and I want to check my stats. My stuff for art class, wallet, iPod, uh, everything, you name it. And there's just essentials. There's my schedule for summer. Here's the bathroom. So, my dad was wondering about this. You turn on the light from here, open up the door. It's a really traditional bathroom. Um, I leave all my stuff hanging to dry in here from the bathtub. And, see, this is what I was talking about. You flush the toilet from here. Water comes out here. And I soap, water, and you wash your hands that way. It'll go for a while, so sorry if it was loud. Turn off the light. And you're probably wondering how I get such a minimalistic looking room, right? Considering how much stuff I have, there's my one essential, right? Well, Japanese closets are huge. Look at this. I basically keep everything in here. And all my clothes are down there. And clothes for winter and summer are down there. And here's my bed. My cell phone I just threw on the bed. But I have my mom's pillowcase from her wedding and my mosquito net and outside they're doing construction so they've put this up to prevent debris someone's walking up there but here's my view so I get lots of sunlight in the morning the sun comes from there and just kind of beams really nicely on the bed and 
see. And here I get the nice sunlight. And then at the end of the day, which is kind of nice, you get that afternoon sun comes in from those windows. And it's really quite beautiful in the tummy mats. But this is my house. And there's not much to show you, but I'm glad I got to show you. So this I got in Harajuku. It's pretty sweet. I really like it here. It's really nice and peaceful. So that's it. Thanks for watching. Fire, 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 raging all about. Here come the firemen to put the fire out. A small, small ladder, up it goes. A small, small fireman, small, small hose, squirting water on a flaming wall. But the big, big fire. Oh, <laughs>